filled that role pretty well, averaging 16 a game on the season right now. Powell off the screen, got to the bucket, and scores his first boom. Powell knocks down the short mid-range jump shot. So he's been out a while. Tennessee State, famous HBCU. Paul George to the bucket, kicks it out to Powell. Got it. Nicely done. First minutes together. 29 games, but a career high, five and a half assists, anticipating the big, the pitch to the corner. That's a great delivery. Shamit a little bit late on the challenge. Army Zubats with the rebound. He also had a pretty strong argument for his guy Booker as Powell books one from the corner. Powell goes to his strong hand, high off glass over Biombo. It was fun, you know, um, uh, I was ready to come back. Um, you know, I'm excited for uh, what we're building here. Uh, I know the guys were excited, um, you know, playing along PG uh, still doesn't seem real to me. Um, you know, he's a guy that I looked up to growing up. Uh, guy, you know, we had some battles in Toronto in the playoffs and um, early on in my career, he gave me some some words of encouragement. Uh, my rookie year, uh, you know, that stuck with me. So um, to be able to play alongside with him uh, and Kawhi uh, when he gets back healthy, uh, it's going to be fun. You know, so I'm definitely looking forward to that. Uh, I had a great time out there with the guys. So I'm um, just looking to build. I think the biggest challenge is just being out in general. Um, I hate missing games, uh, especially uh, when we feel like you know you could help out there um, and then this other thing was just uh, my conditioning you know um, lower body injury you know, it was kind of tough to stay in uh, game shape uh, but I thought uh, the medical staff did a, has done a great job in just uh, keeping my body uh, in shape uh, trying to replicate um, my uh, <coughs> conditioning uh, you know, being on a bike or the Versa climber through the eight weeks, um, trying to mimic uh, my gameplay and the numbers that I put out for all the stuff that they uh, keep track of. Um, I think that was like my biggest worry. I think it's just talking, you know, uh, you know, just seeing how we're progressing, see how uh, all of us are feeling, uh, going through our own uh, rehab uh, process, uh, staying with it. Uh, anytime we saw them, each other in the gym, uh, being positive, um, Especially uh, during uh, PG's ramp up stage, you know, just uh, you know, just talking to him, seeing how he was feeling, um, where he was at in the process, where his mental at, how um, everything is going. Uh, I think we've all done a great job with that. Anytime we see each other, you know, we ask and make sure you know everybody's spirits is up or uh, we're progressing the right way. Uh, one thing that they always told me was to take my time. You know, don't feel the need to rush back, especially with how I am. Um, I'm always trying to play through injuries and things like that. Um, even after the first initial um, uh, <clears throat> fracture happened in the first uh, game in Dallas, you know, I tried to play in that second one, uh, going through a different warm-ups and stuff during shoot-around. Um, but I just couldn't do it, you know, and I was kind of bummed out. Um, so they know my, my, men, uh, my mental approach to the game and how much I put into it. Um, so just making sure that, you know, I was taking my time and doing the necessary steps uh, to get myself fully healthy. Um, yeah, I do a lot of uh, mental work. Um, I have a, a mental uh, health coach, a uh, lifestyles coach, David Nurse, that I've been working with uh, for a while now. And, um, you know, I practice a lot of meditating and things like that. I usually do it um, during, like, the starting lineups um, you know, uh, while they're calling everybody's name. But um, I always try to find time just to take some, uh, some time to myself uh, during the national anthem and uh, on the bench. Uh, just to center myself, uh, remind myself to stay in the present moment and uh, uh, be uh, be still. Uh, so that's what I was doing. It was amazing. Um, I was joking with him, and I told him everybody that I know that's had a, a career night like that, the next game to get five points, two points, so this <laughs> better not be you. Um, but, yeah, he shot the, the lights out. Um, you know, I, I knew it was going to be. Uh, a big game when he got the ball in transition and ran to the three-point line, shot faked in, and switched to three. So, you know, he, he was having himself a night. Um, I was proud of him.